Just that one three-pointer that Clemson loves so much. Just one three-pointer thus far. Brooks turn around left of the lane, finally stops the streak. Shot clock to 13. Eels needing some offense. Nifty pass from Harris to Sharp for the bucket. Prosper just got out of the way when he saw that jet coming down the engine. Walt on the left wing. Shot clock down to nine. Dribbles to the top, now over to Love. His three is good as he rattles it in. Now pitches over to Love, quickly in the post to Sharp on the left side. Crosses the court with the pass to Walton. Feet set, three-pointer, nothing but net from Kerwin. Harris, left sideline, now it's Davis, up high to Playtech. He'll try a three from straight away and strips the net. And just two offensive rebounds, which came on the final possession in that first half. Let's see if Carolina can do something a little better here in half two. And it starts off well as Kerwin Walton, for the third consecutive game, he'll draw up a play out of halftime for Walton. And this time he buries the three. Can the Heels get some stops and points together? Carolina gets it down low to Sharp, and he throws it down with two hands. Uh, but Carolina has to find somewhere to take that baby step, and so rebounding is a good place to do it. We've talked about why that impacts so many different aspects of the game. A lob on the entry, Davis to Brooks for the finish. Charging in the offensive category, but he is really using his body. Brooks passes out of a double team to Walton for three. Now goes to Playtech on the right wing, trying to drive against Chase Hunter, nothing there. In the post to Brooks on the low right block. His turnaround fall away, swishes home. So Tigers have not been able to take advantage of Carolina going one of its last seven as Love hits a little push shot in the paint after pushing the tempo. 